Every year, the public sector undertakings, PSUs of India, offer ample employment opportunities, especially for engineering graduates. And who wouldn't want to work in such prestigious government organization as IOCL, DRDO, ONGC, etc.? There may be many other reasons too why many people aspire to make a career in Indian PSUs, such as job security. Yes, it is worth having a stable job in today's unstable employment environment, prestige, various allowances, etc. So, what are these PSUs? Public sector undertakings are the organizations that are entirely or partially owned by government or are classified as Maharatna, Navratna and Miniratna based on their net worth and annual turnover. There are nearly 300 public sector undertakings in India. PSUs generally recruit the candidates through the competitive examination or based on GATE scores. And in some cases, the candidates are directly recruited during their campus placements from the top institutes such as IITs, IIMs, IISC, etc. In Indian PSUs, the average CTC of employees is around 12 to 15 lakhs per annum. However, there is a misconception that there are not enough opportunities in PSUs for those who belong to computer science domain. But the actual scenario is somewhat different as many PSUs recruit candidates from the CSIT field. Here, in this article, we will inform you about the top 5 PSUs for computer science engineering in India with all the details such as eligibility, recruitment process, salary, etc. Indian Oil Corporation Limited Indian Oil Corporation Limited is one of the prestigious public sector undertakings and the largest commercial oil company in India. IOCL, entitled with Maharatna stature, has been accomplishing the country's energy demand for nearly the last 60 years. Yes, it's almost 60 years. The company has around 33,500 employees with a revenue of approximately 6,600 crores. IOCL offers career opportunities to CSIT candidates by recruiting them for the profile of engineers, officers. The candidates recruited as engineers, officers and IOCL are posted in one of the various disciplines in the organization, such as information systems, refineries, etc. Let's look at eligibility criteria, selection process and other aspects of the job profile. Educational eligibility, BEB Tech with at least 65% marks, age limit. The candidate's age must be maximum of 26 years as of the year of recruitment. There is a relaxation of the age limit for reserved categories. Selection process. The candidates are shortlisted based on a valid GATE scorecard, followed by the group discussion, group task or personal interview. Pay scale. Candidates recruited as engineers, officers, receive a starting basic pay of 60,000 rupees per month and various allowance such as HRA, DA, etc. The gross remuneration to the organization is around 17 lakhs per annum, including performance-related pay. Bhaba Atomic Research Center, BARC Bhaba Atomic Research Center, BARC, headquartered in Mumbai, Maharashtra, is the nation's premier nuclear research center. It has an immense infrastructure for various advanced research and development processes. BARC offers career opportunities to CSIT candidates by recruiting them for the profile of scientific officers. The candidates are recruited after training in orientation courses for engineering graduates and science postgraduates. Graduate Fellowship Scheme for Engineering Graduates and Physical Graduates Let's look at the eligibility criteria, selection process, and other aspects of the job profile. Educational eligibility BEB Tech BSc, 5 year integrated M Tech and Computer Science discipline with at least 60% aggregate marks. Age limit The candidate's age must be a maximum of 26 years as of the year of recruitment. Selection process The selection of OCES DGFS is made through the screening round followed by the selection interview and medical fitness round. The screening of the candidates for the selection interview is done in two ways. Either by an online screening test or a gate score, candidates can choose any one or both of the mentioned screening alternatives. Pay scale. Candidates appointed as Scientific Officer C receive a basic pay of Rs 56,100 per month and various allowance such as HRA, DA, etc. 
Oil and Natural Gas Corporation. Oil and Natural Gas Corporation, headquartered in New Delhi, India, is a multinational crude oil and gas corporation. ONGC produces nearly 70% of the nation's crude oil and holds the Maharatna status. The company has around 34,000 employees with a revenue of approximately 8,76,487 crore. ONGC offers one of the best career opportunities to CSIT candidates by recruiting them for the profile of programming officers. The recruited candidates can be posted anywhere in India or other countries as per the organization's requirement. Let's look at eligibility criteria, selection process, and other aspect of the job profile. Educational eligibility B. B.Tech in Computer Science, Information Technology, Discipline with at least 60% marks. The postgraduates in the Computer Application and Computer Science are also eligible. Age Limit the candidate's age must be a maximum of 30 years as of the year of recruitment. Selection process. The candidates are selected based on a valid gate scorecard, followed by a personal interview process. Pay scheme. Candidates recruited as programming officers receive a basic salary of rupees 60,000 to 180,000 rupees per month, along with an annual increment of 3% and various allowances such as TNS allowances, HRA, performance related pay, etc. Power System Operation Corporation Power System Operation Corporation is an enterprise that manages the power system operations and comes under the government of India. POSOKO is responsible for the efficient and steady functioning of the integrated operations of the grid and it also operates five regional load dispatch centers along with the national load dispatch center. POSUKU offers career opportunities in the disciplines of computer science by recruiting the profile executive trainees. The selected candidates are liable to be posted anywhere in India and other countries as per the organization's requirement. Let's look at eligibility criteria, selection process and other aspect of the job profile. Educational eligibility BE, BTech, BSc in Computer Science, Information Technology, Discipline with at least 65% marks. Age Limit The candidate's age must be a maximum of 25 years as of the year of recruitment. Selection Process The candidates are selected based on a valid gate scorecard followed by the group discussion and personal interview. Pay Scale Candidates recruit as an executive trainee in Power System Operation Corporation Limited receive a basic salary of 60,000 rupees to 180,000 rupees per month, along with various allowances such as performance-related pay, group insurance, gratuity, etc. Defense Research and Development Organization Defense Research and Development Organization, headquartered in Delhi, is nation's premier military research and development organization under the Government of India. With around 30,000 working professionals, DRDO has been empowering the nation for nearly 60 years. DRDO offers career opportunities for CSIT candidates by recruiting for the Junior Research Fellow Profile. Let's look at eligibility criteria, selection process, and other aspects of the job profile. Educational eligibility B. B. Tech in a computer science discipline with valid NET, SLET, GATE scorecard, or ME M. Tech in computer science discipline pass with the first class division. Age limit. The candidate's age must be a maximum of 28 years as of the year of recruitment. Selection process. The candidates are selected based on a valid gate scorecard followed by the written test and interview. Pay scale. Candidates recruited as a junior research fellow in DRDO receive a basic salary of 31,000 rupees per month and various allowances such as HRA, DA, etc. If you are a CSIT candidate and want to make a career in Indian PSUs, then you can consider the above-mentioned organizations. However, regardless of the job profile, your hard work and determination lead you to the success point. So, work hard and achieve your goals.